Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's going to be an impromptu video. Um, basically, you'll be able to see by the title, I took the Ancestry DNA test and I've got my results back and I want to share with you guys. So basically, you get a little kit like this, it comes in a box and you get a little pamphlet and inside the box comes a tube um, which you have to spit into. Like, I thought it was gonna be, you know, a quick Mori Povich, who's a father, swab, swab. Like, no, you have to full on spit into this tube, loads of it. And then you've got like this solution that you have to mix into it carefully. And then you also have the little uh, pre-posted box for you to send it back to them. And then it goes into processing. And uh, it can take anywhere between six to eight weeks to process, maybe longer depending on the time of year that you send it off or if loads of people have sent it off. Um, mine took around five weeks. So a quick bit about me and feel free to skip this part, but both of my parents are black Caribbean, they're Jamaican. Um, on my dad's side, my great granddad is white British, so far as I know. And I believe it's a similar case on my mum's side, but maybe a little bit further up. My mum's mum, my grandmother, uh, is quite fair skinned, fairer than me. So similar kind of thing going on there. And also on my mum's side, there's maroons, which if you don't know briefly, is basically a mix of indigenous West Indian people and straight African people. So uh, kind of close, quite close, immediate link to Africa. Uh, so, <laughs> sorry, I'm like, my adrenaline is like through the roof here. I've always been interested in Who Do You Think You Are programs and all those documentaries. I just, I'm so intrigued by what has come to make us as a unique being, like the people and the things that have come to make me, me, all my features and everything. It just intrigues me so much. And I do quite want to find my traces in Africa. Uh, so if I had to guess, I would say, out of 100%, I would say anywhere between 60 to 75% um, African, and then depending on that percentage, anywhere up to 20% indigenous uh, Caribbean, and then the rest of that European or whatever else, that could be in there. Uh, a lot of people in my real life and on YouTube have asked if I'm Nigerian, so it'd be quite interesting to see uh, if Nigeria comes up or if it comes up quite strongly to see if people can, you know, recognize their own people. And I do hope to have a majority African country just so I can be like, wow, I'm Ghanaian or I'm this and really study into that country. Of course, I don't care like what mix of stuff I have. I'm very interested in the whole thing, but it'd be cool to say I'm from here in Africa and like research more about the culture, the food, the history, the languages, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> so <laughs> uh, without further ado, I think I've covered everything. I hope I have anyway, but I'm just buzzing. And if I cry, it's just the adrenaline. So, <sighs> right. Oh, I forgot to say the kit cost me, I got it on an offer. So it was 74 pounds and then it's 20 pounds shipping. So just under a hundred pounds, but usually it's a hundred pounds for just the the kit alone, but I will leave the link to it below. See my results. Oh my God. Where is this? Oh my God, I'm like shaking. My <laughs> ancestry, I'll just read out the uh, percentages as they go. Um, I am 77% African and 20% European and then I have trace regions in West Asia. Oh my god. Um, I am 30% from Benin and Togo, 20% Nigerian, 12% <laughs> from Cameroon and Congo, 7% from Ivory Coast and Ghana, and then I've got 8% trace regions. So 4% Senegal, so Senegalese. 2% uh, Africa, South Central hunter gatherers. 1% Mali, and less than, or it says trace, less than 1% Africa, Southeastern Bantu. 
from my European side, I am 9% Great Britain. I am 4% Iberian Peninsula, 2% Ireland. I didn't think I had any Irish. I always thought I had Scottish, no Irish at all. 2% uh, Scandinavian, 2% <gasps> Europe West and less than 1% Europe Jewish. I am blown the hell away. And then my trace regions from West Africa, it just says Caucasus, so that's the Middle Eastern area. So a lot of people did guess right, Nigerian, but I am more than in Togo. That is crazy, which is right next to Nigeria. Now the DNA test tests over 700,000 genomes, so it can only test as many as they have. But I'm, I'm certain that people have come up with uh, Caribbean before. So it's quite interesting to me that nothing Caribbean is coming up at all. But that might just be my particular genomes and my particular DNA and everything that's filtered to become me. Whereas perhaps someone else in my family would show up with more Caribbean. I don't know. So yeah, typical native from Benin or Togo is up to 82% and I have 30% of that. Wow. So those are my DNA results. If you're ever interested in this thing, I highly recommend it. Go get it tested. One, two, three and me, I think it's called and all those other ones, whichever one that you feel would suit you, go and get it done because it's just so interesting. I'm gonna phone my mum now, I think. But yeah, that, those are my results. <laughs> Uh, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you on the next video. Bye!